We will conduct a practicum on determining the level of quantitative carbohydrate analysis of the loaf school method. Enjoy, Enjoy the video! Create a sample using a mortar and postal. Clean the skull and dry elemayer flux on the balance and tear its wig. Weigh sample of 3 grams put into elemayer flux. Not the simple way. Add 100 ml of 3% hydrochloric acid solution and magnetic stirrer. Reflux for 60 minutes at 300 Celsius after boiling lower the temperature to 250 Celsius. After 60 minutes, cool the flask to room temperature first then with a damp cloth. Next, neutralize with 30% sodium hydroxide solution. Check the pH with litmus paper. Add a little acidic acid solution so that the atmosphere of the solution is slightly acidic. Transfer the contents of the Erlenmeyer flex to the 250 ml volumetric flex. Add enough aquarius and make the final volume 250 ml and homogenize. Filter the sample solution. Complete the filtration and collect the filtrate. Take 10 ml samples into the Erlenmeyer flex. Add 25 ml of Lufsko reagent, boiling stone, and 15 ml aqua this into the flask place the flask on hot plate regulate heat so that boiling will begin in 3 minutes after boiling continue to heat for 10 minutes cool the flask to room temperature first then with cold water when it cools down add 15 milliliters of 20% potassium iodide After that, cover using aluminium foil. Then, add 25 milliliters of 25% sulfuric acid. Do it slowly. Prepare a beret. Add a standard sodium thiosulfate solution 0.1 normal into it. Mm. 
초등학교 영어 수업 시간에 배웠었던 현재 진행형 같아 하루에 열번내 마음이 움직여 Immediately titrate with sodium thiosulfate until pale yellow. After that, add two drops at starch indicator. Continue titration until the color milky white. Not the final burette reading of the sample titration. Add 25 ml of loaf school reagent, boiling stone, and 15 ml aqua dish into the flask. Place the flask on hot plate. Regulate heat so that boiling will begin in 3 minutes. After boiling, continue to heat for 10 minutes. Cool the flask to room temperature first, then with cold water. Next, add 15 ml potassium iodide 20%. After that, cover using aluminium foil. Then, add 25 ml of 25% sulfuric acid, do it slowly. Titrate plank with 0.1 normal sodium thiosulfate solution until the color is pale yellow. After that, add 2 drops of stark indicator solution 0.5%, continue titration until the color is milky white. Drop again, if the drop is still blue, continue the titration until the color is milky white. Not the final bore volume from the titration plank. From the determination of carbohydrate content in the energin sample, it was obtained that the carbohydrate content was 16.76%. Thanks for watching! <laughs>